Hello Dollface, it's Kat here, and if you couldn't tell from the title, today I'm going to show you everything that I loved in the month of February and do my February favorites. February was actually a very, very rough month for me. I went through a lot of personal things that were kind of rough and sad, so I kind of was a little absent from my channel. I'm sorry about that. I had a lot of videos planned for Valentine's Day, and it just, a lot of things happened that I couldn't do it. But I am back and my mental health is a little bit better, so I'm ready to put out a bunch of new videos for you guys. I have so many fun ones planned, so I look forward to that. So let's get going with everything that I love this month. Starting off, the first thing that I absolutely adored and I've been using like crazy has been the Urban Decay Full Spectrum Palette. Now I know a lot of people were like, oh this palette sucks, pigmentation, whatever, but I am in love with this palette. Like. I understand the pigment is a little bit hard and you have to build it up, but once you build it up it's fine and I've been able to use this for everything. It is just so colorful. It has been helping me so much with my 365 days of makeup looks. I've been having so much fun just picking out colors and creating new looks and A plus for any of you colorful babes out there it is actually on sale for 30 something dollars and I suggest you get your hands on it if you like doing really fun colorful looks. Also, sorry if you hear a little bell, my cat won't stop being annoying. What you gonna do? Cats are cats. The next product I really really love this month and I use so much and I've used so much for the past two months actually but I didn't do a January favorite so it's also my February favorites is the Kat Von D Alchemist palette. I have a whole video on this of swatches and just the way you can use it. I love it so much. It's so beautiful. I could just stare at this packaging forever. I have been obsessed with these highlightings. I love a colorful highlight. I think they look super, super cute on any skin tone. They are just so beautiful and so pigmented. I have been wearing the crap out of pink opal. It is on my cheeks right now underneath this glitter. I am obsessed and I will wear it on any look and any time, any day. Like legit, just look at this. Like blinding, oh my god. Purple is so pretty too. I just, I love it. I love this palette. It's amazing and I hope I don't run out of pink soon because it's my favorite pink highlighter ever. <sighs> Another highlighter I've been really obsessed with and it's so funny because I just went from Kat Von D and now I'm going Jeffree Star is the Jeffree Star Skin Frost and I know I am a little late to this game. I just got my first one this last month and I've been obsessed. I picked up Lavender Snow which is the one I've always wanted and I just I just like, I don't know, I don't know why I wasn't buying them. I don't understand why I never bought one before. But he was having that free shipping sale, and so I was like, okay, you know what? That's it. I'm gonna cave, I'm gonna get it. And it's beautiful. I just put it all over my face all the time, on top of my lipstick, a cup of my eyeliner, on top of everything. It's just so freaking pretty. I love it so much. I love the consistency. And just like, ready, ready? <gasps> Bam. Like, look at that. Look at that. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous gorgeous. And to keep going on the whole highlighter thing, on top of all my highlights, I have been loving, loving, loving putting the Martha Stewart craft glitters on top of it. I used to do resin crafting back in the day and I have a whole bunch of these glitters. And I saw a couple people like Adora Delano using it and Jeffree Star was using it and I was like, oh my gosh, like I love glitter highlighter already. And now just, I love this so much. I just think it makes any look extra adorable. I have the hearts on my cheek right now. This one is my favorite. It's the like clear, it's called Sugar Cube. It's just, oh my God. Can we zoom in on that? Like, so beautiful. There has been one primer that I have absolutely been adoring this month and that is the Etude House Face Blur. This makes my face look so smooth. It makes my face feel smooth. I just love it. I love the consistency. It makes my foundation stay all day and nice. I mean, it smells like baby powder, which kind of bothers me a little bit, but honestly, it's worth it. The packaging is so cute. I love a Tude House, and I just, like, this is my favorite primer right now. I love it so much. The eyes, I think everybody's been talking about these. I think everybody loves this. This is product is amazing, and I need all the colors. I only have one, and that is the Stila Magnificent Metals. I have the shade Ballet Baby, which is just, like, glittery pink, which is my life, glitter and pink. It's so pretty. I've been wearing it. It's on my lids right now. I just, like, ready, ready? Glitter. Oh. Like, it's amazing. It stays on my lids all day. All you need to do is press it on. You just use a little spatula, dab it on. I kind of blend it out with my fingers a little bit or a brush. It's perfect. Absolutely 
perfect. Love it. A plus Stila. I need all these shades so bad. Also on the eyes this month, I have been loving the NYX Faux Black and Faux White Liners. These are amazing. These are so amazing. I only have three colors. I have the Periwinkle one, which is in uh, Baby Powder. I have Oxblood. Oh my god. A red eyeliner like this is so beautiful like this is everything I've ever wanted it's a deep red eyeliner it's beautiful 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 and I got midnight which is this a navy blue and it's so lovely I, I I wear them on my waterline all the time I don't wear a lot of black eyeliner I don't know if you notice that in my channel or any of my looks I don't tend to like be drawn to it as much as I love black I don't like black eyeliner that much I'm usually wearing like a metallic liquid liner or I'm wearing one of these like this is it these are my life these are amazing. They stay on all day. They're only like $7 and they're just A plus NYX. A freaking plus. Uh, there has been a couple of lip colors that I have been obsessed with and I've been wearing them over and over again this past month. And that is the Milani Amore Matte Metallic Lipsticks. This one is in the shade, oh crap, uh, my Soul Matte. Love this one. It's a beautiful, beautiful red. It's just a beautiful red metallic. It lasts for a while. It's so pretty. A plus. I also like the shade Chromatic Addict. Uh, I don't have that in front of me right now for some reason, but it's just a lovely metallic nude and it's very, very pretty. And I can wear these. I actually wear these sometimes as eyeshadow too because they're really, really pretty on the lid. Uh, pink wise, I have been loving Kat Von D's Melancholia lipstick. My sister in law actually got this for me for Christmas and I have been wearing it so much. It is so pretty. It is like the perfect shade of pink. It's, I don't know, it just, it's just a nice pink. I love pink, okay? Pink is my fave. I love it. And I also, for lips, which is kind of a different, it's the opposite of the pink, is I've been wearing the NYX Lip Lingerie in the shade Scandalous. It is like a gray brown color and it's so pretty. I love it so much. I, I'm obsessed. Just, that's all I can say. And finishing off, I've also been wearing Teddy Bear by Lime Crime a lot. This is the collab with Melanie Martinez, who is one of my favorite music people ever. She is so cute, and I just love this shade so much. It's so pretty on, it looks so good on so many skin tones, and I also really like it as eyeliner. Um, the final favorites in my beauty products is the Anastasia Dip Brow and Ash Brown. I used to be all about taupe. I wore taupe all the time. That was the only brow color I wore forever. But I was kind of getting, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it anymore. I like very dark brows against my light hair. And I had a sample thing that came in with my Ulta order one time. And it had the little dip brow samples. Like I had black and ebony and granite and ash brown. And so I used the ash brown one just for fun to match one of my wigs. And I became obsessed and I went and bought it the next day. It is what I'm wearing in my brows right now. And it is my new favorite brow color. At least for now. I can't say forever. But for now it is. Now, moving on from beauty, we're gonna go into some fashion and accessories. Uh, for one, this dress right here, super cute. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. I found this dress at Walmart for $10. $10, so cute. It has a little heart cut out, and actually the heart is supposed to be on the back, but I flipped the dress over because I think it looks so much cuter in the front, and then I went and bought it in every color. I don't have the red one in my hands right now, but like, it came in pink, and pink is so cute. Just look at it. I like, I've been wearing these nonstop. If you ask my friends, they're probably annoyed of seeing these dresses because I keep wearing them. I don't ever want to take them off. They're just perfect. They're so perfect. Uh, another thing I've also been loving this month is wearing berets in my hair. I just think they're adorable and they add just such a cuteness to every look I do, especially with this dress. It looks so cute with this dress. Oh my God. And I have them to match every dress color. Ha 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 And to make them even cuter and to just kind of personalize every outfit, I add a little pin to my beret. And it's been like my favorite thing to do. Just put a little pin in. So I keep all my pins in this super cute Valentine's Day tin that I got. And it has my husband, Kylo Ren. Baby. And I keep all my pins in here. And I'm a collector of Disney pins. So a majority of my pins are from Disney World. Because I have an annual pass now. So it's a little bit bad. Because now I just keep buying pins. And so I'll show you some of my favorite pins. I have this super cute Marie. I love it so much. Can you... I have this little Marie pin. 
And then one of my favorites is my Husbando pen, my Kylo Ren pen. My favorite pens is my Hercules and Meg pen. Can we get that focused? I love this pen. Hercules is my all-time favorite Disney movie and I just, oh, favorite pen. So I really love collecting pens. I want to get start getting other ones that are not just Disney pens because there's so many cute enamel pens out there. Like I need all of just peachies. Oh my god. They're so cute. So I want to start getting into those instead of just branching off from my Disney pens. But I've just been putting them in my little berets. I just feel super, super cute. And then also with the berets, I have been wearing this double bun Leia hairstyle almost every day. Uh, I've kind of needed it uh, when I'm having like a rough patch. Sometimes I just think, what would Princess Leia do? And she's just been my inspiration for life. Uh, Carrie Fisher was one of my idols. She was so strong. And whenever I just need that extra boost for the day, I put in my Leia buns and I just feel like I'm ready to go. And I love this hairstyle so much and it's so cute with the beret. So yeah. And to finish off accessories, I also got a new purse this month that I think is so adorable and it just fits my aesthetic so much. And I found it at Ross for $15 and it's just this cute little Betsy Johnson little handbag and it's pink with little white daisies and the inside is black and white stripes so it's like me, you know, I have two moods. Super, super pink and girly and like super dark and grungy. And then again, I got a little Kylo Ren here, my little bae. He makes little talking noises. So that is just, I just feel like this fits me so much. It's just basically me in a handbag. My favorite wig this month, and I think I'm going to do this like every month, I'm going to have a favorite wig. Tell me if you'd like to actually see me do like a favorite monthly video, if you'd like me to see my wig collection, I would love to know, or even like my Disney pen collection. Please comment down below with whatever videos you'd like to see me do. I want to make more and I want to make what you guys want to see, so please tell me. But this has been my favorite wig this month. It is just a beautiful dark green. I used to never think I would like green hair. But I've actually been obsessed with it. Like, I used to, I don't know why, like, when I was in high school, I was like, ew, I would never have green hair ever in my life. But this wig has changed my, just my opinion on it forever. And this was only $7 from eBay. Uh, a lot of the wigs I buy are for my makeup looks and not really to wear out. I mean, you can cosplay with these too. I just love it so much. And I have so many cute looks planned for it that will have this wig on. So yes, this is my baby for this month. And the final favorite of the month is I got some Tsum Tsums that I've always wanted and I was at the Disney store and they had these on sale for $2. $2, okay? But look at them. I got the whole entire Aristocats family. Wait, where's Marie? I had Marie. Where is she at? Well, I've had Marie forever. Marie was an older one I've had. Where did she? I just had her in my hands. Okay. Marie, I have her too. But look at them. They're so cute. I love them. <gasps> Yes, I just love Tsum Tsums. I love them so much. I collect a bunch of them. Also, this one wasn't part of the sale, but I had to get it. Is the cute cupcake 2017 Tsum Tsum with little Minnie Mouse on top. And like she has a little party hat on. I just, it's so cute. And I, oh my God, it kind of smells like cup. Is this supposed to smell like cupcakes? <gasps> it's supposed to smell like, I just realized that. Oh my God. But it's adorable, and I love Tsum Tsums. If you would like to see a Tsum Tsum collection, please comment down below, because I have a whole bunch, and my collection's not as big as others, but I love them, and I think they're adorable. So that was everything that I loved in the month of February. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and please tell me what your favorite things were this month, or if we possibly had the same favorite things. Also, please tell me if you like some of those video ideas I threw out, and if you wanted to see them, and tell me whatever other videos you would love to see me do, because I want to create the content you guys want to see. You guys are my main focus on this channel. I'd like to thank you guys again so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, because that would be so cool. Also, if you'd like to be notified whenever my videos come up, hit that bell down below. I hope you guys stay lovely. Bye! He loves me. Little cutie, 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 my little Kylo, my little Kylo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So now I have to do the rest of this video with a cat on me, right? Do I? Nope. Okay. Bye, Kylo. Bye bye.